And I think it's really cool to see how like my art has taken shape over the years. I think it has been like very political at some points. Now it's pieces that like sort of inspire like reflection and just center like the bodies of Native people, um, Native women in particular from <clears throat> like settler colonialism. It's really like special for us that like Navajo people have the matriarchy. Um, the leadership in our tribe and our community has been through like the women in um, the community. So motherhood and um, the female body is just like really important in like my artwork. I do um, intend to continue like advocating for a change. I think just personally I've realized that our sovereignty and self-determination has been defined for the Navajo people by capitalism and by the U.S. nation state model. Traditional Navajo like um, beliefs there's like um, eh, which is like kinship and family um, and that included like the non-human life so like the animals and plants and land and then also like each other. For me and like how I interpret it is like keeping balance with the earth, having spirituality and just having a balanced life, but also like, like in our government, we need to be implementing that, but they haven't been doing that. So they endorse a lot of like pro-capitalist like casinos and like um, resource extracting um, projects and a lot of just things that are like counter what we have believed for many generations, like many centuries.